Welcome back to the Primax Vintage Wa Shootout for another exciting exploration into tonality. Today we'll be checking out two signature Wa's designed by monster players, Steve Vai and Jerry Cantrell. Introducing the Jerry Cantrell Crybaby and the Morley Steve Vai Bad Horsey. The Dunlop Jerry Cantrell Wah was the brainchild of the Crybaby team and iconic Alice in Chains guitarist Jerry Cantrell. Created to replicate Jerry's dark and moody Wah tone, the Cantrell Wah is custom voiced for a tight, punchy heel down tone and includes a fine tuned knob that lets you control the toe down frequency for maximum tweakability. The Cantrell Wah is also designed to provide a wider and darker sweep response than the Crybaby while still offering up that sweet Crybaby sound. Let's see how the Cantrell Wah sounds with a funk styled riff. Today Chris is playing a Fender Strat through a Fender Twin Reverb. Here's his clean tone. <laughs> Since the 1970s, Morley has been the leading producer of optically controlled wah pedals, as opposed to the traditional potentiometer based ones. It comes as no surprise that when Morley teamed up with guitar hero Steve Vai to create the Bad Horsey Wah, it would raise and set the bar for the industry standard in optical wahs. Designed to replicate the sweep range specified by Steve Vai, the Bad Horsey features a switchless design for a smooth feel and tone. Let's see how the optically based Bad Horsey sounds with a funky sounding riff. Cantrell is not known for holding back when it comes to rip and distortion, so let's hear how his wah handles a fuzz pedal. Chris will be playing Voodoo Child by Jimi Hendrix through a Black Arts Toneworks Pharaoh set to germanium mode. Here's his fuzz tone. As a shredder, Vi is also known to use massive amounts of saturation while he plays. Let's hear how the Bad Horsey's optical design plays with the fuzzy tones provided by the Black Arts Toneworks Pharaoh. Wow, 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 wow. 
Thanks for tuning in. Don't forget to subscribe and tune in tomorrow for two more fantastic sounding wah pedals put to the test. Thanks for watching. <laughs>